So it is 11.55. I'm just trying to clean up this kitchen a little bit. Has anyone tried these, these beauty bursts? I won them off of a vlog, which, by the way, thanks, I received them. I've been eating two of them a day. Um, haven't noticed anything that I can really say yet, but I've only had them for like three days now. But it's supposed to be like extra collagen for skin hydration, collagen enhancer, skin rebuilder, good stuff for your skin and um, hair. So I'm going to try these and I, I'll do a little review on them after I'm done with the bag. Um, and I will let you know. But yeah, I'm trying to clean up the kitchen a little bit from the breakfast dishes this morning. And then Crystal is home. She needed a, a mental health day. She has the F cat, eighth grade F cats coming up and she's really upset about some of her grades that she has. So we um we're gonna just kind of chill for a little bit and um grab some lunch here. And I will um, check back with everybody later. Okay, Crystal and I um, needed a little shopping spree. So we went to Walmart, looked around, and I picked up the new um, face wash. This is the Deep Pore Charcoal Cleanser. I'm going to try this out for a couple of days, and then I will have a review here on my blog. I'm very interested in seeing how this does on my skin. Crystal has one of these two in her bathroom, and um, it actually came with a dollar off coupon that we peeled off and used today. So, um, like I said, we're interested, we're going to try it, and then I will uh, review it. And then, of course, we went to Bell's Outlet because I love looking at Bell's Outlet. It's um, kind of like TJ Maxx, but um, we don't have one here in the small town we're at, and this was easy. And... Um, when the kids are, you know, not feeling well, or I know there's issues, or at school, I don't like to travel very far from the house, and this is very convenient. So, we had fun today, just kind of browsing around. And I'm going to just slip everything out, because this bag is really crinkly. Um, we didn't buy a whole lot. I picked up another package of the washcloths for the girls' bathroom. Um, these were only $3.99, and there is a um, six of them. They're just in a chocolate brown color, which I really like, but um, I don't know what they do with their washcloths. It's like they chew holes in them while they're in the shower, but um, yeah, so I'm going to start slowly replacing some things, um, and this is just a start, so, and they're really soft. I like them, and then um, the shirt that I got for me, because mommies need something special too, is this really nice dark blue um, navy shirt. And I really like it because it has the lace detailing on the sleeves here. And then if you flip it over, it has it on the back. And I think this is going to be so pretty with that long um, hanging gold necklace that I just showed you in my previous video that I have hanging up on my new jewelry organizer. I think this is going to be so pretty. And I'm um, excited to wear it for tomorrow. This is just the receipt. And um, then also there is a lady selling some of her daughter's clothes on the local Facebook site that I cannot say off of. And so um, there was this Air Apostle shirt for Crystal. I picked that up and it looks really cute. She loves these Air Apostle shirts, but um, yet again, we don't have one close to our house. So whenever I can find these at our local thrift stores, Goodwill, what have you, I definitely pick them up because they do wash well. I'll throw this in the washer and um, she'll get many uses out of it. It has no holes, no tears, and no stains. And um, so this was a great buy. And then she was able to pass this one on to us too. Let me open it up here. This is just also a typical blue Air Apostle shirt. 
that Crystal will get many uses out of. So I was able to pick up that one. And then she just messaged me, but I'm not going to go out again for a while. The kids are home and we have to start homework. But um, she has a pink one, this Aeropostle, that I'm going to pick up. So, yeah. So we had a little fun excursion. Crystal, like I said, needed a little mommy time, a little special attention. And some days you just need a little special attention. I remember when I was going through some issues in school and I would um, spend a couple of hours talking to my mom. And I always felt better afterwards. So, yeah. We built some memories today. Um, so there's that. Um, it's only 3 o'clock in the afternoon right now. The ki It's Wednesday. The kids are home early because on Wednesdays they get home early. Um, yeah. So Crystal is actually across, across the street with Joey, our horse. So I'm going to walk across the street and check up on her. Hey! Okay, these two are home from school. Tell us what you're watching on TV. Mom, you said you're coming! Okay, what are you watching on TV? Tanked. 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 And they're having a snack, and they just threw their stuff down. But we have to start homework in a minute. I don't have homework. So he just um, kind of weeded the roses here while the kids are doing their homework, what they can. In a little while, I have to take Abigail to tutoring. We found a tutor that um, she goes to on Mondays, Tuesdays, and Wednesdays. So I have to drive her over there in a little while. But I'm um, just enjoying this nice day, and oh no. Oh well, I don't know why I keep that in there. We all know it's yellow roses. This one here is about ready to be a goner. But this one just opened up. Isn't that pretty? So, and then I think I have more blooms coming up. More little buds down there. I'm glad the frost didn't get to them. I like it. Okay, so I just dropped um, Abigail off at tutoring, and luckily it is in the same plaza here as Aldi's and Staples. So um, I've been sitting here for a few minutes. I had a couple of chapters left in my book that I'm reading, Starter House, and I finished it. Um, I was really excited when I bought this book, but after just a couple of chapters into it, I was getting a little bit irritated with the main character, Lacey. She seems to be a whiny pregnant wife, and, and that's just in my opinion. Um, seriously though, if you're going to move into a new house and weird things start happening, and you have feelings that something is not right, you see things that are just not right, you should probably tell your husband. Don't try to keep it from him, and, and uh... Yeah, it was, um, I mean, it, I, I think it was her first book that she's ever written, but it just, I don't know, seemed kind of amateur to me. I'm going to let my daughter read it because this is, there was absolutely nothing in it that she cannot read at this time. And, um, you know, I love to watch scary movies and I, um read just about every haunted house book that is and has been published. So when I saw this, I was really excited, but, um, I have to say I was kind of disappointed. Um, it was not one of those that kept me reading at night. I was able to just read one chapter and then put it down without even a second thought. Um, so there's my review on the starter house. I mean, go ahead and buy it and pick it up and read it yourself. I would probably just get it from your library. Um, nothing too scary happened in it, so if you don't like anything that scary, you just like a little bit of a mystery about why the ghost is in the house, this would be it. So, yeah, I'm going to go into Staples now. Um, I read online that Staples was having some great um, clearance sales. And I think I want to try to pick up some K-Cups for my Keurig, because um, I want to stock up. And I got some coupons, and with the sale prices, 
It should make for a, a pretty good deal. And then I want to look at some of the Martha Stewart um, kind of stationary items while Abigail's in tutoring. And then I'll go home and we will make dinner and that's it for now I can think of. But that's what I'll do right now. I'll go right Okay, it's 5.24. I need to pick Abigail up right across the parking lot here at 5.30. I just got done with Aldi and Staples, but sadly, uh, Staples didn't have any of the K-Cups. They were already gone. Um, so that's okay, you know. It's okay if I miss some of the deals because... The sales, they always roll from one week to the next, and I'm just not going to stop what I'm doing, cleaning up the house to run out to, you know, buy something. So I was a little disappointed, but yet again, I know that that deal will roll around again, or somebody will have a K-Cup on sale. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go get Abigail, and then I'm going to go home, and we're having shepherd's pie for dinner tonight. Okay, so I got shepherd's pie and garlic bread in the oven, and I've got some tea on the stove. I'm going to throw some ice over it and have some sweet tea. i got to finish putting away all the dishes, and I'm going to call it a night because I am hungry. Homework is done. She's actually catching on. So glad we got the tutor. Looks like we might give Crystal some some extra help, some extra needed help. And that is our Wednesday. I hope you guys are enjoying your dinner, and we'll see you tomorrow.